YouTube, we are back. Top Shelf TV is back. Shout out to everyone who watched the grand opening episode. It was awesome. Sadly, we didn't really get much content in here. I might've got some stuff on my GoPro, but honestly, we've been jam packed busy. Haven't even got a chance to get to my personal content. So there's that. We're here. As you can see, we got this beautiful wall. A couple of things sold off this wall. I'm not sure if I said it in the preview video, but I kind of joked with the guys and I said, this wall is going to be really awesome to look at, but it's probably not going to sell that well. So far, that's been the case. The walk-in customers have definitely been going to the used section next door which is totally cool but a lot of these new pairs have been selling online shout out to everyone who's been hitting us up on ebay instagram buying things you guys are all the best the t-shirts the sneakers the jerseys hoodies whatever you guys are buying you guys are awesome we're definitely trying our best to get you guys great product great inventory great pricing and uh, it definitely shows so one shoe that sold nine and a half midnight navy just because i've seen a lot of comments about it we have made a change to the team evan is no longer with us we wish evan the best evan and i pretty much had a mutual agreement that uh, he wasn't the best fit for the team anymore we had to go a different direction things happen obviously this is a real business we're not actors over here so things happen and that's what happened we love evan wish him the best but uh he will be no longer with us for right now so another shoe we have to get off the wall is this powder blue 10 right here we're gonna grab these so we're gonna take both of these we're gonna get the boxes and then we're probably gonna meet you guys at the used section store so we can pack up everything like we used to see what sold talk about it check in with the other guys and uh see what else happens today but it's good we are back and as you can see see we got ourselves some sales here shout out to everyone who ordered a t-shirt i guess we will try our best to down the line just shout out some names wayne from virginia jared from florida omar from cali joe lewis from texas louis from texas gary from cali tj from cali excuse me if i pronounce this wrong alvino from texas y'all are the bomb appreciate everyone for the support there we're gonna try our best to get more gta shirts because a lot of people have been asking for them and like on opening day we sold out a size large and xl and all that let's look at the order zone man we definitely have some random stuff it's actually hilarious because three pairs here i got from the flea market two of them from one person one of them from someone else can you guess which pairs they were probably pretty obvious to see boom the fusions these are crazy if you know you know they definitely tried to do something cool here and uh that's about it they definitely tried we got the unc very rare westbrook edition which you never see these i got these and the qua 54s from the one vendor at the fleet we got a super super clean pair of the royalties right here check the apps on those brand new they're really high shout out to the dude who hit me up i believe his name is garrett he hit me up this morning for the 12 and a half fire red three he said i need a 12 and a half not a 12 or 13 12 and a half we had it we're gonna get those shipped out to him midnight navy four happy to sell those because i feel like we haven't sold a pair of those maybe maybe like one or two but uh they haven't been selling the violet rush gatorades used more shirts and these right here the cpfm uh flea one i believe they're called i was excited to get these in a 12 when i got them at the sneak show thinking I might want to wear them or keep them and then before I knew it they sold on eBay so one man's trash is another man's treasure this is definitely something I know a lot of people probably wouldn't be messing with me personally I think you know they're different to each their own can't forget about the pandas and the velour not velour corduroy corduroy, corduroy. Houston Astros hat $70 there but we sold that for I think 40 shipped or 45 shipped and the camelback can't forget those things have been selling for us thankfully Jordan anything for the people and then we'll get Berwin and Armando's take on uh, the orders today Shout out to everyone who bought a t-shirt, especially the GTA ones, because a lot of people have been asking about those since we posted them on Instagram. Really happy to see them go. Have like a couple smalls, 3XL, a couple 2XL. So not many left, but shout out to everyone who's been buying them because you know, we really like these t-shirts. And you know, to me, they're like one of the best t-shirts up there with the buck one. You know, it's bound for first place. But again, shout out to everyone who bought a t-shirt. Shout out to everyone who pulled up to the grand opening. We really appreciate it. That video is about to drop soon. Sorry, so, drop. Oh, so <laughs> Berman dropped the video. He did his thing with that one. Uh, really, really cool. Special day for everyone. So shout out to that. Shout out to everyone who bought something. Really like the Why Nots. Those are really, really fire. Just a really good basketball shoe, in my opinion. I know they look a little weird with the laces getting covered. But really, really fire. The Kawhi 54s, another good shoe. Fusions, like A said, they tried on that one. Pandas can never go wrong. It's like the new Air Force. So $100, can't go wrong with those. Cactus plant overgrowns. I like those shoes. I like them shaped down, though. I don't like it with all like the fur. Grinch Street looking thing going on. 12 and a half, fire red threes. One of those sizes in there we really pride ourselves on because you know 12 and a half is like a really weird size. So we could get those sizes and then we get really happy about that. The Gatorade, Violet or Rush Purple, whatever it's called. Side note, hot take. Purple Gatorade is the best way to Gatorade. Just saying. Oh my god. 
hot take, very hot take. Probably get a lot of slander. I'm okay with that. Rarely ever sell those Midnight Navy 4s, but for some reason, we always buy them. And happy to see that I finally sold one. How you guys doing? My name's Armando. I've been with these guys now for about a week and a half. Never thought I'd probably be working with them. You know, always shop with them and traded with them. Here I am now, behind the scenes. And we're going to be packing up your orders very soon. Get them out today. I do really like these, uh, these cactus plants. I agree with Jordan. I believe they look a lot better shaved down. I do like these Midnight Navy 4s. I didn't think I would like them, but seeing them now in person. I do like the color in that nice little uh, navy going around. Not too much as well. Fire Red 3 is really nice. I like the Nike Air. I'm always, I'm always a big fan with the Nike Air on the back on Jordans. Gatorades. Not really a fan of those colors like that, but to each his own. Got the classic pan dunks. Everyday shoe. Can't go wrong with that, even though they're being hated on right now. A lot of people can rock with those. Quiet 54 is pretty cool. Reminds me of like the TV scatteredness around when you watch. <laughs> <laughs> We've been telling a lot about the Top Shelf 3 kicks. They've been going out like hotcakes and shit. So I appreciate you guys for buying. Oh, as always, we're gonna get your orders out very soon. They shopped to people who've been buying the camel bags. So that's probably like the most flea market <laughs> buy. Because <laughs> this is like, this is like so many. They consistently sell, which is funny. So shout out to the person who bought that. We've been selling those like all summer. So yeah. What's <laughs> up, so guys? It's your boy, bro. We're back with some orders. But I wanna address two things. One, I do see all the comments about the audio. Sorry about that, guys. We're still trying to figure out what the best way as far as audio and visuals are in the store. So definitely gonna work on that. Two, I saw a comment that kind of annoyed me the other day about Erwin, you try too hard to talk to these people or you treat these people like they're regular people, not celebrities. Guys, everyone that comes in here, doesn't matter who you are, doesn't matter your background, guy, girl, kid, family, whatever. I treat everyone here like they're family, like they're celebrities and we want to make everyone feel special. So if you have an issue with that, sucks of you. And other than that, give us suggestions about what you guys want to see in the store now that we have more space, now that we have more uh, inventory and there's a lot more content to be filmed. You know, a lot of your suggestions and recommendations will take into account especially now just because there's a lot more to film so that being said let's get into the orders first i want to talk about those overgrowns because i kind of low-key regret selling those i think i sold this to the right, store right. yeah i hit on retail <laughs> and now that i keep looking at them and i keep seeing pictures i low-key would want those back fours always going out whether it's midnight whether it's some um, royalty fours have been somewhat good for us uh, as of recently fire red threes can't go wrong with those classic right there Five fifty fours, classic sneaker right there and like armando said the midsole does kind of remind me of tv static those are called west Brooks, right that's also a very underrated model i do like how it's different not like every other jordan model like how the unc logo is just right in your face the gatorades it's funny enough we always sell the gatorades whether it's the purple ones the blue ones any other color those always seem to sell not as fast but they sell eventually and the tsk shirts shout out to everyone who's been buying those and everyone who's been showing love on the logo shout out to a on that one i was talking to a this morning actually like ever since we dropped the video yesterday the shirts have been selling od so we will be having a restock soon and with that being said, love y'all. Appreciate everyone who came out to the grand opening. That was awesome. And shout out to everyone who's been subscribed and commenting on the new video. More content on the way. All right, guys, we're back. I want to get some content real quick today because I feel like I might be running around and we might be filming in here. We're going to make sure to get the best recipe filming, whether it's filming in here and in there, filming in there on this day, here on this day, whatever it is, we're going to make sure to get you guys awesome content. And again, I can't stress it enough. We genuinely, extremely, really appreciate the support. Everyone's been walking in, getting good deals. Everyone has been selling us stuff because it seems that that's what we've been doing a lot of lately which is totally okay we've just been buying 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 a lot less selling but that's okay it is what it is speaking of selling Birkenstock basically brand new I mean I probably could have said they were brand new but the dude told me he, he wore them for like a day or half a day or an hour or whatever but I uh, didn't expect these to sell they sold really quickly we put them on eBay and we got a DM on Instagram shout out to Adam I believe he's from Maryland greatly appreciate the support there we're gonna make sure to add these to the order batch and get these out before we go look around the store just a little bit gotta talk about one thing that happened recently obviously a lot of things have been happening since we've been closed like too many things can't even kind of talk about all of them at least right now but one thing happened I figured I'd talk about just because things happen right in business it is what it is we got these back from eBay we love eBay guys like you guys know my relationship with eBay Berwin loves eBay we all love eBay over here this to me was just like a very weird occurrence that it's like didn't make sense we got this shoe back and it has a post-it note on it and it says look what does that say bro and fake right but look how it's like written it's just like a very odd sneaker to be called fake and we're just gonna die Dive into the sneaker Air Max up tempo 95 as you can see there we got the suggested retail uh, we got the label up here and we got the sneaker man they are beat we did sell them for the low but uh, one thing is for sure these things are not fakes you know I'm not sure who was working that day they might not have had their Red Bull monster or coffee and it's just odd to me that uh, people have these jobs and they can't recognize a sneaker like this from being authentic like again they are super worn but they're real and again just another bump in the road again we love eBay we know it's humans humans make errors we make errors as 
well, like things happen, but uh, that was just a weird one I wanted to talk about. Speaking of what I wanted to talk about, this was a little more filled today, but every day it seems this thing fills up with sneakers that go out to the used wall. I try to come in and price them. Guys, we know we got to get the basketball hoop in here. We have one in the back, but we know we need one out in the store so we could do one and dones and, and all that stuff. So we're working on it. We're working on a lot of things. We're going to continue to change things up in here just so you guys know. Back to here though. Cool grays, UNC 4s, Bread 11s, Hobies, Lightning, Midnight Navy 4, Midnight Navy 1. He got game. Seafoam 4, some Jordan 1 lows, some core purples. And then we go to some other stuff that I priced earlier. Protection packs. We got the LeBrons in here for the 40. Air Hawks. We got the Dunk from Above, Maroons, Racer Blues, China LeBrons. I mean, remember when the nines, I mean, everything was the nines. The nines was just like a total time. And uh, we got these in here for 125. And I'd assume we take a hundred. Chatter backboard lows. And then we just been filling this thing up, man. We try our best to fill it up every day with sneakers. As you can see, these are more shoes that I priced randomly today. Kobe's, Foams, Air Max, Off-White, Protection Pack. You just look at this wall. It's absolutely absolutely absurd it gets absurd every day it changes every day and uh it's really cool to see all these new shoes come in that's something that we always try to pride ourselves on obviously whatever we could do to make sure we have the variety and the awesome prices and deals for you guys we do that lights aren't on i gotta put the lights on as berlin just grazes upon that wall so that's what we got going on today it's a rainy gloomy day outside sadly of course a t-shirt that sold out of the 5,000 items i feel like every time we sell something it's the one thing we don't have or we can't find so I've been going crazy for hours trying to find this like $40 t-shirt. I can't find it. Probably going to run home to my garage, look through there, try to figure out where the heck this t-shirt is. So I just wanted to show you guys what's going on in here. And again, this is just incredible to me to see all the variety. And I know we're new here and it's going to take us a while to get that traction back of the traction that we had. And that's okay. Honestly, it kind of reminds me of the old days because I've been sitting in that store next door and uh, people aren't really walking in or the people who are walking in don't really understand the concept. And that's totally okay, right? Like we believe in the brand we believe in what we're doing the culture of this even though a lot of people think it's shifting to online only and all that stuff we want to be one of them ones that still has that opportunity to provide customers with a place they can chill talk about shoes it was really cool yesterday some young kids came in we sold a pair for what 20 25 bucks and uh, he was really geeked to get them they were the kukinis and like to me that that's what it's about like all those memories that people are going to come in here and remember it's, it's just like really cool everyone has loved the store so far and i feel like we still have such a long way to go when it comes to concept and social media and additions and bringing in new stuff and price drops and like all that stuff I feel like we're just getting started and we're super backed up too I gotta shout out the guys for trying to get to everything because they've been on it when it comes to inventorying taking pictures listing stuff these guys have really been working their butts off trying to make sure that we have all this stuff up for you guys and we're as organized as possible so when you guys come in we can really provide a great experience and again gotta shout out all y'all for watching because y'all are the best the video yesterday I mean the love y'all are showing is crazy I think we almost have 20,000 views it hasn't even been 24 hours which is crazy because you know trying to get 20,000 views in 24 hours is like a, a goal that sometimes we achieve so to see that on that video is crazy man and uh, we're so excited to get back to it to film and to just show you guys sneaker history sneaker deals sneaker nostalgia like whatever it is involving sneakers we want to continue to provide that to you guys and again like Berwin said anything you guys want to see drop it in the comments and I love what Berwin said earlier real quick about the celebrity thing because that is true when I started my store one of the big things was getting a celebrity to come into your store like fat boy like shout out to fat boy but you know fat boy he had this whole run of coming into stores and like knocking things off the wall and just like acting really goofy and cool and getting all these views and that would like help the business or brand grow and there's nothing wrong with that i like understood it but i didn't because again i feel like it's kind of pointless to treat a celebrity like a certain way and not your daily customers a certain way i feel like our daily customers should be treated like celebrities because they are to us right they keep our business running but that celebrity that comes up in here and posts on their instagram once that's not what we're about we're about the long-term goal and the long-term goal of providing people a service and a great experience in a store and inventory and all that stuff so i didn't even have to talk to berwin about it he decided to talk about it so he hit that nail around the head just all of our customers and celebrities because y'all are the best a lot of the people who came they brought bottles i got flowers just incredible man y'all really the best so definitely all family to us and we appreciate the support and we're happy to get back to it because y'all have missed the content and we're excited to bring you guys crazy content going forward what's up guys we have a little new system going on now to make our lives easier here. Whenever we get new inventory in, new used, we have a section for that. From there, then it gets inventoried, whether it be me or Jordan that does it, or Mondo, or anyone in here. Then from there, we clean it, goes to here, our trusty light box. Then it'll be on eBay for you guys to buy. Right here behind me are a couple of shoes that came in. OG Tom Sachs, the yellow ones, right there. And then the 
the brown ones. This, these are really great fall sneakers. So, if you guys looking for like a fall sneaker, brown. Don't you have top all three? Size. I might have all three. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't know. Okay, I've run the jewels. How do you feel about these? I think if they didn't do the pony hair and just kept it like pink and black, just regular leather, with a little bit of hope, but I wouldn't wear the pony hair if like Nike gave me them. Right. Me and Jordan are low key trying to get these. It's lowest of oh, yeah. keys. Our size is really low brand new, but you know, we like to use it here, so. Use eight and a half, use nine and a half. Yep, yep. These are really like low right now. Nike and other foot sites have been restocking these consistently. So if you guys are out there trying to get these, be on the lookout. Me and Jordan were talking about how these are type I. The black cement Jordan one low. Pretty cool sneaker. Nice design on this one. Then last but not least, the Kobe Mambasitas with the GG on the back of the left foot. They're actually on both. I didn't know that. They're actually behind both sneakers or both sides of the shoe. So pretty cool sneaker. These will probably be at the new store with a bunch of other new inventory that we're going to send over. That being said, Glad to be back. Mondo's currently over there stocking the shelves with you stuff. Jordan's currently listing and getting to offers and stuff like that. And hopefully Friday and Saturday are gonna be busy for us, especially Saturdays. We'll talk about the fit later. <laughs> as long as we, can, the same we, thing. we can talk about the fit later. Burn bro sound crazy. I did buy something crazy. I, 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 what it is. I want the whole experience to Let's come to say. come about because I did have them shipped here. Whoa! Yeah. Also shout out to all our neighbors around the, the block. They've been coming by saying what's up, showing us love, so that's pretty cool. I had this really cool idea of going to every store or every uh, little small business and bringing a shoe just to see what would they say about it. Everyone's been showing us love, whether it be our neighbors, customers, and it's been really awesome. So catch y'all on the first buy. Like pieces. Nah, you're good. And you, you just cashing out or you trading today? I actually want two or three pieces. It's a um, the CB34, size 11. Okay. And it's a, it's a Orlando Matthew jersey you got too. I think I know what you're talking about. Gritty? Yeah, with the stars? Yes. Yep. We just got that on Saturday. This one, right? Yes. It's, it's a large, right? Large. Yes. Mm hmm. You gotta check that out. That was good. You sure? Yeah. That's for my son. Yeah. 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 CBs were. A size 11. Oh. It was, a, it was a new CB that just dropped this year, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. I think that's something. I saw one on your, on your Instagram. Yeah. Yeah, I was trying to get around like 12.50. For everything? Yes. Okay. I'm assuming this is the used stuff right here. And I think only thing, only thing that's used is... The Brave Blue? The Brave Blue, I think, yes. Mm -hmm. And this pair is the wrong box. The Bodegas? Yeah, those are actually um, white and red uh, 12. Okay. And was there anything else or was it just that stuff? Um, let me see. I'm trying to, so you're killing me, Jim. I'm trying to cut back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because yeah, you came by on Monday, right? Yeah. All, all that stuff. Yeah, right. we had, we just, it just wasn't up yet. Uh -huh. yeah, no, what's Born and raised? Uh, yeah. Those, yeah. Oh, everybody wants those. I know, man. I've never two of these. Are we still buying these? Which one is it? It's the ball. Nah, we got so many. Yeah, I'll probably pass on these for today just because we're backed up to the lot of these. Especially with these. This. And then you want the dark blue. Yeah. Let me see this online. How much do you think this is online? Let's see it on the eBay or. Uh, you said it wasn't online? I didn't see it just now when I just checked. Um, uh, let's see. Yeah, yeah, hey. Yeah. How much for oh, hey, how you doing, bro? this All Star one? He said it wasn't online. Yeah, just check this. I need to see it. Size that one. Oh, XL. Where are we on the other ones? Oh, I'm not even sure. I want a lot too. Twenty-five. Somewhere around there, yeah. He's taking the pet. Uh, yeah, I want the pet too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, 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 no. The, the Matt uh, McGrady. Oh, the one I, we just posted. Mm -hmm. I had a feeling that. They were yeah. <laughs> um, probably two on the Jordan. Okay. And we and say McGrady, anything on the penny? Oh uh, no, I didn't. I didn't. Uh, one seventy-five. Okay. okay. Yeah, I'll take the ball piece too. Yeah, uh, I, I, I dropped those two for you. And hey, you said you wanted like around like 1250, 12, somewhere like that. Let me know what, what number you go at. Yeah, you was going to take the Jordan jersey too. Oh, Jordan and Green. Yeah, let me know, yeah, let me know how close we are. I'm, I'm deciding. Sure. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm like a roughly like 300 off from around like nine for this stuff. Mm -hmm. Just like like these, these, the brave blues are low. Same with the CDs. I see the prices, like the yeah. hats and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But like realistically, just like really, really low. So I know you said 180 here, but realistically, this is like a hundred, $120 shoe. The white CBs are a little bit, they're a little bit lower than those. Mm -hmm. So I was at like around nine for everything. Store credit, I will come up with some more, of course. 
I'll drop. Um, he gave you a price for the two jerseys. Mm -hmm. I'll definitely drop the bar for you. So I can see where we have them at. I saw on the Instagram all day. I think it was 260. 260? Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that's fine. 260 Yeah, that's fine. Okay. And when he tell you on the McGrady again? Uh, 175. That's cool. And then he told you two? Two on the so Okay. What, what, what that leave me with? Uh, let me check. So I called it 950, mm -hmm. and then that will lead you for 315. I mean, if you're, if you're unsure about it, you can always leave it because, again, it's not up on eBay right now. And the likelihood of, like, I don't want to jinx it, but the likelihood of someone coming in mm -hmm. and, like, going through and getting that jersey is just really slim. Yeah. Because uh, we've had that jersey for a while. I think we had it in the other store, too. But this one right here. No, that's a clean one. That's a yeah, clean one. Yeah, I like that one. Yeah. I got to take these two at least. I got to yeah, take Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. I'll definitely do those two. That one you can see anytime, honestly. You can see okay. that one anytime. That one, I know they're making a Nike version this year, so like the Orlando Magic's gonna be wearing that jersey just yes. Nike this year, um, but it's not the same quality. No, um, yeah, no. And those CB94s, I would assume they'll go pretty fast because they again, that's a, it's a classic, you know? You can never go wrong with that one. Yeah, I'm gonna take these two for sure. Yeah, can I just see that cold yes, real sir. fast, please? Be all good. Yes. Be all thank set. you. Yeah, no, nah, thank you, man. Hey, Appreciate it. Place. Boom, trade all this stuff for these. And the T-Mac jersey, really classic jersey. Shout out to my guy, Steve. Bears fan, another Bears fan, another loyal Bears fan, man. Been through the ring with us. We got one last night. We're gonna soak it up for the next week and a half. We got a vibe. After that, you guys probably won't hear or see me talking about the Bears again. But again, shout out to my guy, man. He was here on Monday. We did film on Monday. He was here on Monday. He sold us a lot of stuff. Almost 3,000 worth of, well, about a little bit more than 3,000 worth of stuff. Traded some good things in too. So he'll be back again in like the next couple of weeks. So how you feel about the new store? Oh, I love it. <laughs> parking, parking right there now, you know. Oh, I have one of the new cars. Yeah, 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 I got you. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Thank you, man. Good, man. Good. 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 Shit, there you go. Bring these back. Yeah, I need to clean up my collection. All right, man. The pot I am at once. Oh, wait, what? Yeah. Is it brand new? I'm surprised they get their own special box. Yeah, that's the thing. I didn't recognize the box. I thought it was like astronaut or something <laughs> like that. H1T for a number. And how much you look for everything today? 13. 13. It's a diesel. Yeah, I know. Actually, these three. They, they all know? Uh, once. The diesel no, maybe once. Hit this one once? No, for right now. Oh, just try it on? Not even. Maybe I tried it one, but. They don't wear them anywhere. Did you get those on Nike or? I think right off uh, I'm in here. Oh, yeah. I was gonna say, you might be worth returning to Nike if you could, but I know I'm on a to return. Yeah. Plus, they ship them back there. Yeah. I know I'm gonna take a thing, but I just need to clear out my sneakers. Once. Oh, this one? Yeah. Okay. We get this shoe like non stop. Do you? I like that. I just need this. This one I don't really like. I like the 12s. The 12s are cool. The ones, I think, are so ugly. You think so? The ones are so ugly. This one, I think, mean, you can get the sleeve too. This one's used, right? Yeah, I think it's. Yeah. 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 No, I remember you saying that last time. I told you I had all the omnibus. You definitely did. You definitely did say that last time. Did you even wear these? Twice. <laughs> <laughs> I wear those are like. Did you get these new or used? Used, used right? Yeah. yeah. Like a lot of people were pumping at the time for this shoe, making us all first. All right, let me see what I'll be. I do know. Oh, you got those too. I didn't see them. All right. I do know probably these, the ones in the 12s will probably be low, mm -hmm. but again, I can see what market is on them. So I wouldn't be that high, honestly, just because a lot of this stuff, again, low, these are low, these are low. I was at nine for everything. You can't do the album. What's good, bro? Meet you in the middle, 950. 
Yeah. 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 Y
Oh, I don't know. Nothing in mind? Nothing in mind, nope. Next door is y'all's too, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's not over there because still a bunch of stuff in here. Let me see, yeah, nothing in mind, right? Yeah. No ballpark or anything? No, not really. I'm just all fun some things. Yeah. Yeah, they boil them shit, so I don't wear them like that, so I don't know what Honestly, I probably loan all this stuff. This stuff is all going for like pretty low. All under retail, I probably have like 320 for all. Like 350? Uh, how you guys doing? Good, how are you? I'm good. Um, the conditions is crazy good. I it's not that. It's, I know. It's, I it's just it. the price, Trust you know me, what I'm saying? Everything is like under under retail or way That's less. The you know? lowest you could, I mean, the highest you could go. Um, so, I meet you in the middle, of 335. Yeah. He'll help you All right, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Well, I can yeah, do that. I can do that. Uh, what's the best way? We paid you before, right? Um, no. Last time, I ain't, you know, I ain't have no demo or the. Um, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never seen you before. Yeah, the old spot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, you only do cash, right? Yeah. All right. Let me see if you have that. Uh, I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. No problem. I don't wear these shit, so it ain't really no, you know, big deal with it. I already know. I watch it on YouTube a lot, so, so. I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. I do good business. I don't, you know, it is what it is. Dude, for one second, he's going to bring that out. All right. No All right. Yeah. Uh huh. See, they're on the I paid you for What are you asking on, on your stuff? Um, For all three, 675 Okay, where were you at for these two individually? If these are going for under retail right now. I know these are at like two. That's what they're going for. Yeah. Would you like resell these, them for retail? The, these will probably sell for around retail, maybe twenty dollars more. Yeah. So you wouldn't buy them for retail? No. Nah. Okay. These we have a few ready. I hold on yeah. those. Yeah. Um, these are probably interested in. What do you yeah. want for these? Uh, I was looking at two eighty. Two eighty. I would be less than that, but I can give you my prices and let you know where I'll be at. How much you want for this one again? Mm, two twenty. And you're firm at the two twenty? Yeah. Okay, so this one I'll hold on for one. And you're firm at the two eighty here. Uh what would you look at for those? What's your idea? Uh this one I'll probably want to be like two thirty. Two thirty? Yeah. Would you do like two sixty? Mm -mm, it's a little too high. Yeah, that's cool. This one, I'll probably hold up for your firm there. Yeah. This one, we have a few. Yeah. And then I move it, so I'll probably hold up for these as well. That's cool. I appreciate uh, it. Yeah, no problem. You don't have any of the olive Travis Scott's, right? The Moe's? Mm -hmm. Um, wait. In a lever and a half, I would need them in. Mm mm. Okay. You yeah, asked me all this stuff. These. Not much. Say like one, one fifteen on those. Yeah, I'll double check that. Yeah, whatever. These, I'm like so confused on where to put them. Market is weird on this type of stuff. Yeah, they kind of like all over the place here. It's oh yeah, you're good. Um, Market's like all over the place, on Yeah. It's one of those shoes that don't sell well for us. These are used to. Yeah. This one I might hold off on just because yeah, we literally, them. literally just been buying them since we reopened. Yeah. This one, maybe. This one, I can double check. Okay. Are, are these, whatever you want for them. Okay. Let me see where they're at. I don't, I don't even care if you go under retail. <laughs> I'm not, not going to do anything with them. What was retail? Uh, I don't remember. I got them on the... I'm doing How's these. What's going on, man? What would you want for these? Out of curiosity. Anyway, congrats, guys. I'm just going on. Thank you, man. This is a new guy model. They're so oh, weird because okay, new, I think they're going between what like. There are 500 on StockX. I think you guys have a couple of 11 and a half stuff for like seven. Mm -hmm. So I. 460, I don't know. I'm up for like. 
whatever you want. This is the first um, one, right? You got the other spot over there. Yeah. This one I'll probably hold off on too, just because that's where they're kind of consistently selling sell that. So I'll hold off on yeah, that. Yeah, I see. Like, are you um, like lower on them? Like, I'll just probably hold now. off on these. It's like a little like bit hard to move this like, one. Like, I'll take it probably for like 75, though. They're not really doing anything. Yeah, they're not doing anything. I'm good with 75 with those. Okay, what's the best way for you? Zell or Venmo. I can do Venmo. Whatever is easier for you. Can I see a Venmo, please? Yeah. And what about the Yankee one? And was that the only shoe you were trying to trade for today? Uh, I don't know. Look around. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I always got like five ish for this stuff. I didn't look at market, so I'm not sure. Alright. Here you go, bro. If you want to check those out, feel free. Yeah, no problem. Get more tanks. <laughs> uh, I want a good amount. You good? Yeah. yeah. How much you say you would book for everything? I was at like five. I don't know the market. I didn't look. I just off top. Yo. Um, I was at a, this one I was passing on, um, I was at three here. Yeah. Uh, so I basically use these for those. Oh, my fault. I got you. I like 350 with these. You got any, uh, let's go, honey. You bring one so you should check it out. And then I will owe you 50. Oh, thank you, bring it up. Yo, you know, bro, I'm loving it. I'll add it. Loving this shit a lot. Just straight, probably. Remember, he was just in that little store. Yes, basically. Yeah, crazy chunk plug. There you go, Doc. Thanks, bro. I'll see you on the next one. You know it. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you, man. Bro, I got the playoffs. Stickers, please. Yeah. Are those like top five Jordans of all time? Well, uh, um, metallic fives. Yeah, I'd say so. I think they're in my top five. Yeah. I think they gotta be in there. Oh, uh, you need bags? It's not my fault. No. Okay, that's yours. Did you got the other ones? The rest yeah. Of the five? Uh, oh, you got both. Appreciate Yes, sir, bro. Yes, sir. I'm going. You too, bro. Have a good weekend. I was looking around like maybe 1200 for everything. Like 1200 you're looking for? Yeah, most of us use, like, some of us new, just no box. Let's put on the um, Air Max side. Yeah. Right. Separate stuff. Let's see. everything yeah so i feel like obviously this stuff we you know kind of iffy on yeah, gotcha. but i guess i could see where i'm at even even some of these pairs are like a little difficult for us lately to move yeah, it's not that great inventory but 
Just whatever you think, and then yeah. just meet someone, maybe. Uh, what way of payment usually works? Do you have like PayPal, Zelle, Venmo? Uh, I think I have Zelle. Gotcha. You said twelve hundred. Yeah. Like what? What are something like this go for? I think I bought it for like maybe seven, but I used it a few times. I mean, I'll give them away for like fucking hundred. Yeah, just stuff like this, like we don't really know much about. I got you. So I don't know if it's worth like holding on to those to like. I'll give them away for fifty. I'm just trying to get rid of. No, I got you. I got you. Um. I feel like I'd be at like 600 for everything, that's what I'm not really. For everything? Yeah, I mean, there's like the fours are pretty good, the sixes just brand new are like 150 to 200 with box and everything, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, the Midnights have like a bunch of yellowing on them, so like all this stuff we probably sell pretty cheap, you know? You do seven? Um, let me run back through the numbers and see like where I could, maybe I could come up a little bit. Want to meet at 650? Uh, yeah, it's fine. That's cool. Um, you said in Zelle? Yeah, I've never used, like, receiving money, but I've sent money, so I don't even know. You just scan or something? Um, code or something. What do you use, an email? I mean, it's no, it's a TD uh, bank app. Okay, but I'm saying, like, what does it say? Is that your email there, or is it your... Yeah, it's my email. Okay, so let me, uh, let me try to send it to your email and see if your name comes up. Um, what's the email? Uh, I just want to see where you were at. I just want to see what you had in my size. Okay, but I'm saying like you don't have. Price. I don't really have a price. I mean, I can look. Real quick. Yeah, I'll probably look and see what you want, just because you know, try not to negotiate against myself here. Um, yeah. yeah. You know I think I was really just trying to get credit for something for these two. So I kind of want something these. like high for those. So. Okay. If see, anything, so you want to hold one of these? That's cool. Possibly. Yeah. Um, I, mean, I don't know if you mentioned it's it's got probably probably ammo. Ammo. That's what I yeah. figured. They hurt your feet. It's terrible. So yeah, you want to tell me where you're out in the UNC threes and the. So let me know what you're interested in. I kind of we can see like. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Obviously, more credit than cash, right? Um, yeah. So I take cash too, possibly. <laughs> These. Like. 350-ish, around there. So that's true. And the brand fours, yeah. probably around the same for both. Got you. Um, honestly, bro. I know it's a little high. Yeah, I mean, just the market, man. Like, yeah, it's, it's it's extremely difficult to sell these brand new for 450. So it's going to be very difficult for us to make money on a used pair of 350. Yeah. Um, uh, what were you thinking? Lowest use on go is 210. Obviously, those are choke compared to yours. So I'm not gonna go that low, but uh, I'd probably like to be in the 250-ish range here. Is that credit or cash? Um, I mean, it depends on what you're, you're looking, looking at. for and stuff. Ready to so. check out? Yeah. What do you say on That's good. 30 bucks. Is that the one? Yeah. yeah. Uh, These. I like to pay. Card? Yeah. Um, probably, probably similar. Probably the same around. Yeah, That's what I figured. Yes, please. I got you. I'd assume five cash for both a little more credit, depending on what you want. Or what. So what about these, really? I mean, I'd take them, but you said you were looking for the high. Which yeah, I mean, I get they're kind of hard to let go of those, but yeah, I guess, I guess. for the right price, I don't mind. I got you. So new. Yeah. I mean, what are you thinking? There you go for brand new. Right. Thank you. 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 Uh, I mean, if you want to run credit on all three, I'd do 900. 900 straight. So that's obviously if you want to do credit. I want to do credit. What about cash for all three straight? Uh, probably, 850? Probably, yeah, probably 850. All right. I'm going to look around still. Yeah, no, any questions? Yeah. Let me know. At, um, you said nine credit? Yeah. Can you do a thousand credit? Now just throw a hundred? Cash? 
How about we do since you since you told me you're such a gambling man now? Oh, oh, don't get me! Come on, don't do that. How this. about we do a hundred or one fifty coin flip? Hundred one fifty coin flip. Yeah, if you win a hundred, if I win one fifty, so either way. Either way, yeah, yeah. Either way, it's less than eleven hundred. It's like ten fifty. Ten fifty or thousand. Thousand. Uh, yeah. Why not? Uh, why not do the coin flip? Uh, just check out the Sean picture. Yeah, yeah. It should be brand new, obviously. No, they had everything I saw before. Yeah. Thank God. Yeah, they, they got a receipt. Oh, really? Yeah, they got everything. Oh, they have. So, 150, you're calling it? Yeah, I'll call it, yeah. Uh, tails never fails. Let's go Tails. Awesome. I'm like, oh, 10. <laughs> no. Uh, you 100, yeah? 100, yeah, yeah. Good. Hopefully I make that back tonight. <laughs> <laughs> That's the goal. Hey, man, if, you, if, you, if you're up, Get out of there. Hey, what's, what's up, bro? How you doing? That's my what's problem. Up? I'm up, I try to win more, I get greedy. Nah, nah, it's you bad. don't want to do that. Are oh, you in a bag for those? No, no, I'm cool. Appreciate it, boys. Oh, hi, right, bro. Take care. Good one. Hey, How you doing, bro? Huh? Nice to see you, team, bro. man. I'll be back soon. Hell yeah, man. Have a good weekend. You too. Yeah. Nice. Some of them have boxes, some of them don't. Damn, ponies. All right, bro. You know how long I've, I've had these? No lie. Probably 20 years. Wow. What are you asking on this stuff? Oh, bro, I don't know. I literally just fall, fall cleaning and found them in the garage. Let's see. Still looks good. Ah, thank hey, you. Thank you. Thank you. So I might only be interested in the infrareds. Okay. The gammas are just a little too worn down for mm -hmm. me. And then the A6, I just passed them because those regular A6 don't really do that well for them. Okay. I'll probably hold off on the ponies. Okay. And what would you want for the infrareds? I don't know what they're going for, bro. Like I said, I think I'm going to have these one of the things in a minute. Whatever you do this for. Uh, so for these are probably like 130 for the infrareds. Okay. Let's go. Mm -hmm. uh, what's the best way for you? Whatever works for you. Uh, you have Apple Pay, Venmo, Zelle. Uh, Venmo and Zelle. Venmo and Zelle. I'm bring up the Venmo code. That makes it easy to try that. We are back. It's been quite the day. We've been buying a bunch of stuff. We're really trying our best to get as organized as possible, which has been very strenuous for us, making sure everything is priced, everything's online. It's obviously tough because we're buying every single day. More stuff comes in, more people pull up, selling us stuff, training us stuff, which obviously we love, but it's hard to keep up, obviously. Like, you know, everything has to get inventory. We have to take pictures of it. We have to put it online. We have to make sure it's priced right. We have to price it in store. We have to move the used to here, the new to there. We have to move stuff that isn't moving to storage. It's been uh, very hectic. I know for me personally, it's extremely difficult. I don't know how much I said before, but again, it just feels like we're kind of like a new business here and it's gonna take time for the traction and us to continue to get, you know, walking clients and customers. But that's okay, because we're here, obviously, and we're here to stay. So we appreciate everyone for watching. Tomorrow's Saturday, we're gonna see what we're gonna film. In the new store, there's a couple of things I wanna work on maybe before we're like open up there every day. And uh, those things I have to work on are important. So once we're finished with that, we'll probably see that store a lot more. But uh, other than that, we're gonna film tomorrow. A couple of people mentioned that we had no hoop in here which is again we have one in the back and we forgot to do the one and done on grand opening day i think grand opening day we really didn't know what to expect i feel like i didn't really have a game plan as much as i should have for how we were filming where we were sending people it kind of uh, just happened really quickly so obviously if i could go back in time i would love to uh, change that whole aspect up of that but can't really do that other than that we've just been cleaning stuff taking pictures working trying to make sure that uh, we're all set for the weekend we're open tuesday through saturday Saturday, we're closed on Sunday and Monday same pretty much hours as the old store you know maybe one day we'll be open Sunday or Monday but lately guys uh, you know it's always nice to have a day or two off I know me personally my days off are usually filled with working anyways yeah that's about that anything for the people before we get out of here it's like every time we get close to being done taking pictures or cleaning or inventory is like more stuff but it's like good and bad it's more stuff to sell more stuff for you guys to buy it's been crazy like almost the last like you know six days or so it's been
been a long week because we've been here since Monday. So tomorrow we'll make our sixth day. It's been like a lot of hard work, a lot of catching up, just heavy emphasis on hard work, honestly, because we're really trying to play catch up right now, get everything out because there's a lot of shoes. If you see everything over there on the, on the counter, that's just stuff from the last like two nights, basically. More stuff back there. Um, yeah, it's crazy, man. It's crazy, but busy is good, though. You know what I'm saying? So, really happy about that. Shout out to everyone who's been pulling up and saying what's up to us. Shout out to all our neighbors or so on the block pulling up, you know, with the new kids on the block now. So, it's been really good. All the little kids walk by, they come in here, they don't play the Ninja Turtles, they get so geeked out with the shoes. So, it's really good. We're really part of the community, even though we were before, but we really feel like we're part of the community. Tomorrow is probably going to be crazy. It's Saturday, everyone's off. So, everyone who didn't make it last week, I'm going to assume, going to pull up this week. Even people who pulled up last week, probably going to pull up again this week so carry my pig belt over here you know what i'm saying gotta, gotta defend the belt <laughs> burn you got something to say but you kind of skull a little bit so no not yet it's a, it's a free store say what you need to say no, i'm good all right <laughs> let's keep it like that all right but nah, that's that's enough for me man i've been rambling on so oh <laughs> damn i gotta get used to the camera <laughs> being here for now about a week and a half great new experience coming from where i used to work at all my life and being in this kind of environment a little bit more adjusting to get to but i think as the days go on and the more time i'm in here and meeting new customers and people i think i'll be pretty pretty well adjusted around here appreciate so to everybody who's been pulling up the whole week um, you know talking to people letting them know where we've been where we have have not been yeah it's gonna be a really fun experience here so hope to see you guys soon tomorrow we're filming again it's saturday hoping for a busy day not sure who's going to be doing the buying me or jordan maybe both of us maybe we'll do the buying in the new store maybe we won't maybe we'll do it here whatever it is again to everyone pulling up you know we are adjusting still it is an adjustment a lot of stuff people might ask for we might not have it here it might be in storage thankfully that hasn't been happening much honestly a lot of people have been asking for things in storage and then we go and get it and then they say oh i'll come back tomorrow or i'll come back in a week or whatever that's totally cool too but again there's a lot of adjusting soon we will be all caught up and i think once we're caught up everything will be a lot better and maybe i'll be less stressed out because honestly i've been pretty damn stressed out the last couple weeks that's for sure with that being said we're gonna go to the back and i'll get a little baby one and done until we have a good setup out here where we put the uh rim somewhere but as you guys can see it's it's kind of tough to put uh, I guess we could put one against the window. We could maybe drill one into the wall. That's probably the best idea. But for now, we'll go in the back and shoot them. Make sure you follow the shot, bro. Don't, don't just point at the rim and watch the, the ball. All right. how going to hoop. As you can see, this whole little hoop setup we got, you know, nothing too crazy right now. Again, we will adjust. Maybe we'll get a full hoop in here. It's a little close, I'm just saying. I mean, how far can I go? We don't I mean, have right, right, right behind the turf is like perfect, you know I mean, what I'm saying? Let's move this light out of the way. Like a good, like, 6162, you know, that's right there. All right. See you guys tomorrow. Till next time. Oh! You made it? Yeah. First time shooting on this thing, too. <laughs> <laughs> YouTube, what is good? I'm back. It's Saturday. Stressed out. What else is new? As you can see, we got a lot of orders going out. Let's talk about them. We got a few that came off the wall from the new store. So shout out to everyone who placed those orders. These white lows, noble green lows, brand new taupe fours right here. Something, you know, don't see too often. Got some powder blue tents, some Chicago city tents. Speaking of that, might as well talk about it. So, you know, sometimes guys, mistakes happen. One mistake was that I was listed, sold it, didn't have it, trying to get it for the client who bought it. So we paid a little more for it just to get it in time long story short we literally ordered a pair on the 28th and we ordered a pair on the first the pair on the 28th still didn't ship into goat yet but goat decided to uh, keep our money and not refund us and what's today bro and today's the seventh one two three four five six seven at least seven business days it's been plus a saturday and uh, we haven't gotten a refund from goat or even gotten any info on the order that sucks but at least i ordered another pair and it came in so we get that out to the client shouts to you got some cement 11 low some LeBron lows, pine green threes, brand new protection packs, gold medals. It was Drake day yesterday, but I guess it's still Drake day today. And uh, I'm a really big fan of these. They're pretty low right now. So if you like them, grab them. This pair is super, super clean. Went out pretty quick. Valerian's brand new. Shout out to everyone who's been ordering t-shirts. Uh, we're going to order some new ones. So anyone looking for a size, I want to shout out Tyler from North Carolina, James from Texas, Derek from Texas, and Mike from Massachusetts. Greatly appreciate you guys for ordering merch. I think there's one we have to add to the flick, but that's okay. We got the 
the Reggie Bush going out with the Tim Tebow and the Mike Vick going out. Those aren't all going together, but definitely, you know, football season is in effect. The Phillies Flintstones tee right there, here in the playoffs, I believe. That tee is just so fire. We've had it up for quite some time, so I'm glad it's going out. Michael Jackson, RIP. And then we got the Supreme crew neck right there that we sold on StockX. I honestly don't sell StockX a lot, but a lot of times we look up stuff and we're going to put it online and we say, hey, can we sell it quick? What can we sell it for? And uh, those are pretty high bid up there for that. So I figured we'd let it go. We're going to let it go. We got the ACG vest, a very rare piece right there. And we had it sitting in the store for about 80 to a hundred dollars. You know, people kind of didn't understand the price, but that brand new was online for 300 bucks. We sold that one for 130 shipped and it was only on eBay for like 10 hours, if that. And that's about it for me today. Not sure what else I'm going to do other than try to get all this business stuff going. We have a lot of stuff to do, a lot of stuff to catch up on, a lot of stuff to find, a lot of stuff to organize. I have content to work on. I haven't worked on content, I feel like, in a week and a half, which isn't good, but obviously we got to get the business going, but I'm hoping to get a flea market video out for you guys tomorrow. That's always my goal for Sundays. Let's see what Berwin got to say about the orders or Saturday or Drake Day or anything like that. I feel like those Drakes sold specifically because the album came out, so shout out to whoever ordered that. The KD is definitely a classic right there. Gold medals, Christmas days, and all the other KD4s are so great to see. Protection pack with the ACG, that's actually a nice fit right there. And speaking about used stuff, those New Balance specifically came in recently and they're going out, so that's really awesome to see stuff going out really fast. Shout out to everyone ordering all the Jordans from 1s, 10s, 4s, and stuff like that. Shout out to that Philly shirt, we've had that for a while. It's great to see it being shipped out now, just because the Phillies are in the playoffs. Football season is in effect. Shout out to everyone ordering all the football jerseys. And of course, shout out to everyone ordering all the TSK GTA shirts. These are flying off the shelves. So when we restock, make sure to grab them. See you later. What's up guys, happy Saturday. Doing the same thing as yesterday. Gotta go through some stuff. A lot of shoes came in that I gotta put up on eBay. Midnight Navies, these look new. Boom. Infrared sixes. Just got these in. Lucky green twos. Pretty clean sneaker. All star Kobe's. Maroon sixes. For all the trainer heads out there. Valmeros in the yellow colorway. Don't know what colorway this is, but it's a very clean colorway. <laughs> so got these threes in. Got a clean pair of bread fours as well. And UNC threes. Almost caught up with the stuff that we have. But I'm probably going to jinx that because it's Saturday. And a lot of people are probably going to bring in a lot of stuff. So happy Saturday, y'all. Hope everyone's having a great day, morning, night. Whenever you're watching this, we shall see what the day holds. How you doing? Hey. Uh, I know the, the market's like weird on them. Uh -huh. so, uh, I guess the best offer you guys could do. Anything in mind though, like a number? Yeah. I mean, seven or five. Yeah, right. These are new. This is. No, no, no. What you want on these? Uh, if I can get a retail on it. I would get on these. For seven? These are used, right? Yeah. What you want on these? Well, I was looking at these new balances that you guys have. Oh, uh, which ones? The Action Brunson. Uh, the so ten and a half. The um, the Lockheeds or something yeah. like that. Blue yeah. Let's see if they're here. Now I'll go get them. And you want to trade them towards that? Yeah. And get cash they're in the other correct? store. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah I think I saw them on this. How much you said for these again? Uh, oh, actually, yeah, if I can do like an even exchange. Or so these for them and then they're the from the show. I don't think okay, they made it. And then these, you gotta try some on your own or anything like that, have you? No. Yeah. Big SB collector? Yeah, I had the red lobsters. I got the red lobsters. Okay. I have the blue lobsters. Okay. It is the one. I can never find that at a store. Because I prefer I prefer getting them in person. So you, so see, you can see the trial one. Especially since they're older too. See the separation of the sanity and stuff yeah. like that. I feel you. What's the best you'll want to do here? Because this was like no box. Yeah. I mean, how much will you, you think? I will say, if you haven't tried putting them up online yet yourself, I'd I would kind of try that. They're kind of ranging size, from like eight, seven, depending on size, to like over a thousand. Mm -hmm. I think this new location is like, fits you guys perfect. Yeah, it's a better location. It's a bigger spot, um, more stuff to display. Yeah, especially since uh, you guys have so many collectibles. Mm -hmm. Literally, what we're doing right now, we're adding another shelf, so. Um, we're seeing how fast we're already running out of space. Mm -hmm. 
um, which is not a terrible thing, it just means we have a lot more inventory. Yeah. For this stuff, I believe I was at four, and this one, yeah, I'm gonna just wait. So, retail hair, I believe it's fine. Yeah, so retail hair is fine. Um, hair, I was. I mean, I know you said an even swap, but I was really at a even number, like 225 hair. Um, just because I see what they're selling for online, they're selling for viewers like 300 mm -hmm. in the same size condition, stuff like that. Um, so I got 225 hair, or 225 hair, 175 hair, hair was retail, which is 400 flat. This one, I'm just waiting to he comes back to see what it does. He got the active boxes down to 325 for you. And as of right now, I'll owe you 75. He got the action bracket just coming back right now. So I'm right. gonna do that. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah. All right, just give me one second. Like I said, um, action boxes you can try on. Um, I have the V sixes. I have the other one. They do run big, in my opinion, from all the other new balances. I went down like a whole size. Um, you should go down half size of new balances. But again, when you get here, you try one. I believe we have a ten as well. If the ten and a half is too big. I mean, I should be good. Yeah, cause I have a lot of new balances as well. So mm -hmm. I should be good between ten and a half and eleven. Okay. What were you thinking? You weren't sure? I was probably in the ballpark of like, it's like a weird one. I don't know if it's weird enough. Like, like three. And you're just looking for cash or credit or? I mean, I was telling him, like, if I can get like a number on these, and I'll probably come another time if they're still here. And I'll use this as a trade if I bring my stuff. Okay, I would just wait on these because we want to clean them and put them up. I right. kind of just had them on display for right now. So I will wait on these. So you said you want to hold on to these or? Yeah, still want to well, I see? guess for now, yeah. I'm going to hold on to Okay, cool. These I'll take down. Do you check these out? Yeah, hey, check those out. Make, Make sure it's good out. money. Um, these will put aside. We got to wipe them down and put them up. Okay, try them on. Put them in them. Because if you said for me, that model just went bigger. It's like, it's, like a, uh, it's like the 993 model for me. This one was my Oh, then that should be good, yeah. You sure? Half, yeah. Try, just try them on. This one, my, my peace of mind, just yeah, no, for you to, you know, like, ah, yeah, they are good. I don't want you to get home, try them on like them. They are a little big, you know. Yeah. It's dead. You feel good? Yeah. Like, yeah. That's a good fit right there, man. You got them at the perfect time, too, because like, when they first dropped, they were like, thousand or something crazy yeah like, i wasn't trying to pay that <laughs> nah, i'm through you bro like i pay for like something like rare and exclusive yeah yeah 100 yeah. percent. what is the best way to pay you uh i mean zell zell okay specific i mean there was the one um san francisco one that was kind of nice but do we have your size yeah it was in my size but okay. i was like Oh no, I think I'm deciding on just buying, like I might just look at the clothes. Yeah, yeah, yeah bro. Like, that, or a jersey or something like that. Yeah, if you want to look around, take your time. And, and then my brother uh, brought in some of his, I mean, there's a little smaller sizes. I don't know if y'all would be interested. Also a little beat. Yeah, there are beat. This one's kind of beat. This one I'll hold off on. Yeah, that one you probably hold off on is my guess. Probably hold off on that one in the Kyrie's too. I'll probably hold off on. Okay. Yeah, this one, if you want to trade it or yeah. something, look around, see okay. if you see anything. And, um... You can try to work something out. Huh? Sounds good, thank you. And you said you went to the other store already? I have not gone over there. I'll go okay, check it yeah. out. Okay, yeah. I was say, you want, he's in there right now. Right. I don't know how long he's going to be in there for. Okay. Um, I'll go check so if you want to check that out and then come back here, yeah. that's fine. All right. Um, yeah, just let me know. Right. I'll, I'll be right back then. Yeah, no I'll problem. Yo, hey, how much for this jersey? It's not up on eBay. Um, uh, Probably like 35 35 35 75, 105, yeah. and then everything? Yeah, and then I'm trading these in. The shirts too, or no? Uh, no, the shirts he, he just took out from me. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, these. Okay, that's 105. Carbon, right? Yeah. Okay. I'll do these two for that. Straight up? Yeah. Alright. Cool with that. Bag. Brown. Thank you. How we going, man? Don't get your shoes. Oh, Riley. Yeah. Have a good weekend, guys. Have a good weekend. How's it I'm, going? Oh, I got you. Good control from there. Everything new, you. Used. Are we looking for everything? Uh, I have a number for everything. Oh, she's a pro on the game. <laughs> All the kids, they come here, they, they go straight to the game. Yeah.
So what was your number for everything? Uh, so pretty much this was the highest one. I was like 220 here, and then 100 across the board. For the six point oh. one five. Yeah. So I was at four for everything. Um, a lot of this stuff is just really low. Like three were all low, so I had to go under under a hundred for these three, and then I came up with four. Yeah. Need a minute at 4.5. That's cool. Um, you tell you all the time, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. It's like three kids that use kids, though. I'm gonna separate good. Sorry yeah. about that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll find them. Yeah. Yeah. Some stuff some like of them this, like I might hold off right. on just for like certain stuff on to yeah. not okay. moving. This is sitting. I got my hit up for the toe. I'm just sitting. It looks like completely missing. Brand new? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Those are all these are yours. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it. These two, you had to add a shot for you. Check this stuff out. Yeah, that's right. I mean, I see. Yeah. Yeah. Did you have numbers for any of this stuff? Uh, yeah, not really. Okay. This is out the club. <laughs> Alright, let me see. Let me see. I don't know. Oh, well, these I think are low. So I, know. Yeah. I know, like, most of the Jordans, except for probably the Brits, mm -hmm. are probably like 100, 110. Okay. But these might be like 180 or something. I think it's not good. These might be like $80. Oh, we just got one. Wait, I think the carries might be like three hundred. That's the weird. That's the um. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The up color is doing like seven, eight. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I this think, one, I think this one just got to like six. This is the other one. I think it's like red and blue, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think you got this one like one time. The Salades. What did you want for those? The Salades. I probably want to be at one fifty because they're selling for one eighty. I know y'all shook me off. So do that, yeah. Uh, the Camilla, the Air Forces. I know that was the one. Yeah. 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 They put it in the bar for you too. This one will come back to Lucky Room 2. Undefeated. I'm sure. Probably these are better than what I thought. Yeah, the quality, right? Yeah, yeah. Crazy. I was surprised, like the breath. Yeah, we might be able to adjust that price yeah. a little yeah. if you want it. The pink, um, the wash pink. I think they are. The two ones are maybe. Red for the cost because I see they sell for uh, like three ten. This one I'll probably hold up from because they're at a hundred right now. Two. So like for me to take them, I'll have to be under a hundred uh, realistically. Yeah, like what, Save I'll just be low, bro. I'll just pass on them, honestly. They're just slow. If I was you, I'll probably just take the payout yeah, or I'll wherever they're at. I'll bring this one back. Like, you know, this is all in my clothes. Yeah, how's you? I'll just take the payout, which is like 76. I'll take payout for you. Just take payout on that. Uh, this one's like 277, I think. Oh, those are the same ones, bro? Yeah. It's not like in between. So yeah, that's why I ain't like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like these for like my god though. Like, How much did you want for the um I think I was I said like three hundred originally so I didn't oh, like, the Kyrie. Put a sneaker on. They're pretty rare man. Weird. 
I just know I'm not gonna wear it. Like they've been in my closet yeah, since I had the release. Tough, so like a lot of this stuff I bought, and I'm just like, I know of, I'm not gonna wear it. A lot of hoopers buy this. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, like this one at 300. Where you at? Cause like that's a ten and a half, so I already know I can't. Appreciate you telling me. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, of course. Yeah, right. I said, I fucking might as well come out and check it out. And then the Hogan shirt, like I said, yeah, it's up on eBay, know. so we should definitely have it. Yeah. Like realistically, I'll probably be like 75, 75 here. I probably want to be like two twenty five here. That bread. Well, I probably want to be around like two twenty five there as well. These I'll just pass on completely. They're just too low and they're not gonna move for us. So I'll probably pass on that. Um, the lost and found, I'll look at. The, the reverse pandas, I will pass on. Those I'll just pass on. They're at 75. Um, these are a little bit better just because it's, it's undefeated. So how much would you do? I'll just pass. That's 75. I just, I'll just pass on those okay. entirely. Would you say for this one? I don't know. Seven. No, what is that? Like ninety. Sixty. So I was at eighty with my numbers. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, da 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 da. Uh, yeah. Uh. I know for sure I'll pass on. We just been buying so many of them. So lately. Like yeah. What about the other stuff? Uh, which is the four street and maybe the the balloons? I think is right. I just have to check on them. Yeah. You need a receipt for that? Uh, this one now. No, I saw that one already. You know the numbers you're asking for these three? Um, whatever. What's the best you could do? Using so your two? Yeah, it's in the two. Yo, uh, Mondo, can you start bagging any of the other two right here? Okay. Yeah. Um, I will be at 775 for the three. 775? Mm-hmm. Can run it up to eight? That's cool. Uh, what's the best way for you? Um, you, don't, you can't take the other twos for it, like... We just have so many already. Yeah. The same sizes too, which is really? even worse. Uh, yeah, yeah, 10, 10 and a half we always get in those, the past couple of days. You want to show them, like, how you do, like, blurry retail, to be honest? So, it's trying to get rid of those? I would just pass on yeah. them. We have so many. Um, I guess you could do, uh, Zell? Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. How you doing? Uh, what's the phone number? It up here, not really much for me to say other than I could use a day off and I'm happy we're closing down and have a couple of days to do what we gotta do. I know I have a bunch of work I gotta do, but um, you know, it's been quite the week here. Getting adjusted, as you can see, check out the table filled with sneakers that still have to get priced and put up on eBay. Thankfully, we took pictures on mostly everything. We have to adjust, right? We haven't been in business in a location where people can walk in and bring us stuff. So obviously it's gonna take some adjusting when it comes to buying stuff and realizing that, hey, maybe we're we're buying too much hey we gotta stop buying these hey Yeezys aren't selling hey this isn't selling whatever it is we have to adjust and that's okay but shout out to all y'all for watching we definitely appreciate the support everyone has been shopping with us selling us stuff trading watching the YouTube liking on Instagram following us whatever you guys are the best I know on Monday I'm taking a trip and we're co I'm coming back with a lot of other pairs that we can put up for really good pricing so you guys might see that next week like a lot of these retail releases like black toe one lows burgundy five all those will be able to price really well so that's gonna be cool to have them in here but yeah i'm glad to get done with week one that's pretty much all i gotta say hungry tired and gotta go home and do more work anything for the people before we get out of here guys no thank you very much for coming over the weekend it was pretty excitement continuing meeting a lot of new people returning customers that i've never seen before but you probably guys seen them on their videos continuing looking forward to what else is next in this in this place like i said got a lot of dress going up officially caught up since all the buys from last weekend uh, really
really happy about that ebay is topshelfkicks.com everything is open to offer and if you see something hit us up through instagram or ebay oh and we already put in a new shelf so we're probably gonna have to put in more shelves and that's about that guys you know it is sneakers it is clothing it is fun stuff but at the same time it is work it's nice to be back but at the same time it's it's gonna be nice to just try to relax for a couple of days because it's just been non-stop pretty much it Shout out to everyone all right guys see you guys next week till next time peace